Okay, they're landed on land. I think it'll still be an underwater mission, though. It is. Alright, and we'll see, uh, I'll give it a save. I haven't done that in a while. We'll see what alien type it is. I'm pretty sure it was Gilman. Usually they send Gilman to do the bitch work. And we'll find out in just a moment. Missed. And Amanda Roberts sees another one. Go ahead and Neil take an aim shot. Ooh, not a good sign. Might be to Soth. Uh, alternatively, it could be Lobsterman. Yep, to Soth. All right. Not too scary. Much. Like no time units at all. And he's just walking around over there. Oh, you see two of them. Go ahead and kneel. Take an aim shot at one of them. Nice. again. I don't know if you can see him or not. Yes, you can. And you got him. Nice. That's one of my higher ranking people. Commander. Ooh. You as well. Commander Amanda Roberts. Let's get you back in there. Max Chaney, let's get you out. Let's get some of these rookies out of here. We'll have the people in the armor fly and scout. And we'll spot for the unarmored rookies then. Lumidia, get back in the ship so you don't die. Hans Heinz, you couldn't sound very much more German than that. And Vladimir Mansky. I had a few Manskys in my day, they're usually pretty good. Although I don't think the name actually matters much. Now, Krug is a rookie, but I think I'm gonna have these people back here try to snipe him first. Ooh. Since they're in the back of the ship and less likely to actually get any sort of action. Oh, cancel. Let's not abandon. That'd be bad. Uh -huh. Stupid rookies. As all the veterans just take off in the ship when the, ve when the rookies leave. Bastards. Ooh. That one needs to die. Thank you. Beautiful headshot. That's a very large weapon for Dassault to be holding, especially in this situation here. Not a fan. Uh, try to get you all in an area that you don't shoot each other in the back. You see another one. Oh, that one's just standing on top of a hill. He's easy to hit. Max Chaney, take a snapshot at him. Nice, beautiful. Are you, you know, aiming? There we go. And there's another one. Man, tons of them. None of you can actually take the shot, so we'll just have just have Craig take it this time around. You hit him, didn't kill him though. We'll just have to end the turn and hope for the best. Oh, he's panicking. Good. And he actually dropped his gun this time. Oops. 
and Max Chaney somewhat panics too. And can no longer take an aim shot. But snapshot's good enough. Beautiful. Continue westward. And you continue northward. You see another one way over there. This is like how you're supposed to play XCOM on harder difficulties. Just have somebody scouting other people on the other side of the map taking aimed shots at the aliens. Playing this way is... I haven't decided if I liked it or not. It seems cheap. Because the aliens, they don't know who's shooting at them, so they can't do reaction fire. I don't know. But then again, I turned molecular control off because it's unfair for both sides. But still. Still more. Don't know how many to expect. I think like 15 or something like that. Don't know why I have Max Chandy moving out, but he sees one, so that's okay. No line of fire, though. What do you got? Oh, you got that in the way. Hmm. Just kneel down for the time being, then we'll try to get somebody to creep around the edge there. Should be able to see him now. Actually have enough for an aim shot, which is nice. Ooh. Just missed. Alright, we'll just take your snapshot then. Yeah, good job, Horace. You weakened him up. Made, made the rookie job a little easier. I don't know if I can get anybody else a good enough angle to hit him. Oh. Hans can, he just doesn't aim. And Vladimir, I don't believe you can. Because I think that pipe stuff's in the way. Nope, you can. You can just shoot over it. You're far enough away. Nice. Scalped an alien with a bullet. And Krug sees... Yet another. Man. We're spotting these aliens. Wow, I don't know what that hit. It wasn't the alien, though. The media, continue on. Nothing. Keep an eye on the door, at least. Make sure you're facing the right way for that. Uh, who do we got? Who do we got? Greg Thompson with like no time units. Actually, a fairly decent amount of time units. You might be able to take him on. Ah, from across the world. Got him. Sniper Elite. Curving bullets and shit. Get Krug to continue moving out. And somebody shot somewhere. I think that may have been at Lumidia from who knows where. Nobody's fired since. No matter. We'll just keep moving. That's fine. Keep an eye on the door. That's why. No reaction fire, though. You're just going to stare at it. Perfectly fine. Not like I spent, what, like $40,000 to get you on my team for you to just stand there and stare at aliens as they walk by. That's fine. Just keep ending the turn. He should take a step out again. No, he doesn't. He stays inside the ship. He knows better. He is also naked, so the best he could do is throw a grenade, but she's flying, so where'd my soldier go? No, not any of you. Well, horse get back in the ship, but... There we go. Be sure to kneel. Also, be sure to completely ignore the alien when he walks out. Nice. I don't know if there's any more outside. I think I might just have uh, Lumidia here just eh, be a super soldier. And uh, rappel down the side of the alien ship. 
like a true hero. Open the door and say hello to a couple of friends. All right. Let's do it this way then. There we go. We'll just prime a grenade and drop it on the floor. Actually, since the door's open, wow, this would be awesome if I could pull this off. Since the door's open, we might be able to shoot into it. I think there's a giant fucking hill in the way, though. Yeah, that bastard of a hill, like right in front of the door, too. Like the game knew. Ugh, oh, so cheap. Actually, I like how I'm saying that that's cheap, that the hill's in the way preventing me from shooting from across the world. What's actually cheap here is that. That is some bullshit. I'd be rage quitting if I was the alien right now. Be like, what the fuck? It's okay though. Man, I'm really surprised I'm pulling off headshots from way back here. And you should also see him, Greg Thompson. Oops. Uh, are you kneeling? Yes, you were. Wow. You need to work on your accuracy. Go, bullet! Damn. Yeah, I'd be pissed. Skip all of you. One person doesn't even have a gun. We'll put that back on your belt since we don't actually need it. Down to the floors, pop the door open again, step inside, and we see one. We don't have the time to do with him right now. Holy crap. He's a wee little upset. And I think that uh, officially marks the outside being clear, unless there's one hiding behind the ship, which we won't know about for. Good while, Lamidia is going to be here trying to be a super soldier and take on the inside of the ship by herself. Nice, I think he may have dropped his gun or something somehow. The door should automatically close, providing me cover. It looks like it did. Krug, continue on that away. It's a free move. There you go. Crack the door open again and take another shot. He's got his back turned. Bada bing. Squad leader panicked. Ooh. Might be the last one. Actually, I think there's two more though. Yeah. There you are. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's clear out there. I'll just have you uh, meet up on the inside of the ship then. Whoa. All right, he's a little upset in there. He's throwing a little temper tantrum with grenades. Um, he did panic, though, so I'm, I'd imagine he's unarmed, minus, you know, the grenades. Head on over help her out. She's doing fairly well. She's got a couple kills already. So I'd really prefer if she didn't die. Ooh, don't tell me that. Nothing. And Krug, get up to the doors. Don't go in quite yet. You don't have energy or time units to actually make it to the wall when she get inside. Gotta make sure you can actually make it there. I think we're okay. Again. 
just realized that there's actually an easier way to handle this, and that's just flying from the front door up, since that's there. So I'll just eh, run back around here. F float up a floor. Oh, snapshot. There you go. And there we go, and we'll just handle it next turn, since that leads up to the ceiling, providing us adequate cover. Only issue I could see is um, getting shot at from the side. There we go. Wow. Okay. Uh. Hi. <laughs> He's like, uh, really? He just looks at the camera. There we go. Shot him in the forearm. Fantastic. That's that actually went really well. No deaths at all. Fifteen. All right. Hundreds yard bite though, and a bunch of miscellaneous parts. Nice five hundred points. Excellent rating and a bunch of ensigns. Wouldn't have it any other way. And there's a very large dreadnought, alien interdiction. Really like to handle that one. Where are you going? To the Mediterranean. Mm. There's a lot of alien activity over there. A lot of it. Send the Leviathan over. See what's what. Nothing? Okay. Oh, it just took off. It was just to the north. It was like over in London. Transmission resolver in closet four is done. Nice. Fantastic. So then now I can general stores and workshop. And in 10 days, another workshop. $997. Nice. <sighs> Not doing too well with money here. Thank goodness for the amazing technician team that I have providing me with a million dollars every few days. You guys just keep working on that. Supply cruiser. Ooh, where are you going? To the Arctic. Aha. Uh -huh. Floating base attack. Nope. Oh, keep going. Uh, to the sub if you can. Uh. Okay, hold on. Fuck it, let's just take on the base. Why not? Uh. Hmm. I don't have the disruptor pulse launchers, though. Fuck. Oh, I have one. Krug, have it. I'll just have to uh, get him more along the mission's course. There we go. Eh, fuck it. Just charging on in. Letting the aliens know I'm uh, sick of their bullshit. And I believe it's always the same layout. Could be wrong. We'll find out in just a minute. Ooh, nice reaction fire. Didn't notice there's a jellyfish right at the front of the ship. We nearly crash landed into it. And you see, aha, we're on like the opposite side. Okay, uh, I can deal with that. See, because last time we started on, like, the right side of the base, and now we're on the left side of the base. I believe we're on the like, opposite side. So that's... That's okay. This is the big room here, so let's just fucking... 
I'd like to have somebody blow the doors open first, so. Let's huck a grenade. Clear those doors. Next turn. It is nighttime, so I do gotta get indoors as quickly as possible. I wanna be done with this first part as quickly as I as quickly as I can. There you go, that should blow the doors open. Run back inside, that'll allow you to start pummeling the insides. Commander Roberts, get over there. As well as what's wrong button. As well as you, Titania. Head on over there. Let's get ready for anything. The door still stands. Fuck. Alright, I'll just have to have somebody open the door then. Just hold the door open as the rocket breezes by your face. As you're just an inch from major death. Don't care. Get that door open. Peek in. Nothing. Okay. And fly up a floor. There we go. Now you're safe. So this rocket could hit the wall and it'd be okay. Man. Skirting by on that by that hill there. there go. Let's just do it this way. And smash into the door. Ice killed the brain. I don't know where exactly it was, but it was over there. Do you have enough time to reload? Eh, no. Next turn. Uh, and that body is officially disintegrated, disallowing me to get the ammo from inside. We do have a nice clear way in, though. So let's just launch a few more rockets in there. Uh, try to clear that uh, the big room. And hopefully we can be out of here by like turn 10. Turn five now. I, I couldn't imagine doing it. Well, I can't imagine. I've tried it before. Uh, doing a base mission without the um, rocket launcher. It's a complete pain in the ass. That'll be fine. Should work, I think. If I just have it blow up on the ceiling. Oh, that made a nice way in from the top. Uh, we can try that. Whoops, no, you didn't move, did you? Good. I was hoping it would blow up on the ceiling of the second floor, thereby having the explosion on the second floor and be large enough to take out uh, everything. Uh, hoping ideally, but didn't seem to work that way. We do see another brain sneaking up on us from behind. Oh my god. Man, Roberts knocks it unconscious. That's dangerous. I do not like unconscious tentaculates. They are very scary. <laughs> yeah, one killed Draven once. And we see something through the window, I believe. No line of fire. Understandable. That would be very much hex. If we could see it, we see another one. Can shoot down through the window there. Just some poor Aquatoid was just chilling out, enjoying some uh, coffee and cake up there on the balcony, just enjoying life. Took him down, no problem. No remorse. Lots more hidden movement, no actual sign of any aliens. Gotta keep an eye for that tentaculate, though as it is still very much alive. We need to reload you. We need to get more ammo for this too. You only have one shot left. I gotta just head over. And fuck it, blow up. God, I would say blow up there, but I gotta move my soldiers first. Hold on. Commander Roberts, go up another floor. There we go. Let's get you guys... Yeah, okay, you're on the same floor now. Our back is clear. Because otherwise, I don't want the explosion to pierce through the wall and take us out, because that does happen. Oh. There we go. Go up. Across. I 
think. Is that? No, that's not right at all. Holy crap, that was way off. I think that's right. And then, just go. Don't fuck up. Nice. Took out a Tassoth that was over there. See some octoid with a large gun trying to use the elevator. You shot and miss, and holy crap, you see a whole bunch over there now. There you go, let's get you into cover. Get Amanda Roberts in a position to potentially see. Ugh. Something horrible. Really fucking horrible. Just on the other side of the ship. Kneel down, let's keep an eye on it. Should probably get more soldiers out of the ship. Oh, God. Fuck. Fuck. That's bad. They shot twice. The first one missed. I'm pretty sure the second one hit and killed us all. Yeah. Fuck. Alright, next squad. Waste a few time units by turning around. Can't launch it anymore. That's fantastic. There's a brain. I'm glad you can see it. Uh, nice. And hide. Oh, fuck. That's not good. Please hit him. No, don't. Stop doing that. Snapshot. The alien. Nice. Nice. Fuck. We might have an incident just outside the ship. No, okay, we're good. Luckily the brain is just hanging out there. It's like, what's going on? That killed it. Nice. Alright, and use that last torpedo. don't know exactly where they were shooting from. But imagine over there. Go! This is the last rocket. Hopefully it did some good. It didn't sound like it. It sounded like it may have just killed one. One whole soldier. It's a soft soldier, that is. Now let's try to get you guys split up a little more. Keep an eye out that way. I just kind of look in most directions there. Oh. Fuck. They are pissed off. see someone that you can't shoot. I tried. And Krug no longer has any usefulness. Try to get people split up on multiple floors so that way we minimize the damage dealt by their PWTs. There we go. Since, once again, explosions do not occur on multiple planes. More hidden movement. No signs of anything. Nice. 